All right guys, so Mariah just got home from her nail appointment and she's about to walk into the garage. She's gonna open up the garage any second now. She just backed into the uh, driveway. So I'm gonna try to scare her. Hi, baby. Funny. <laughs> welcome home. Oh <laughs> Gotta give her the old welcome home surprise. Nobody's safe in the Marble House. We're gonna go inside because it's freaking hot in here. It's like 98 degrees out today. What? Oh, it's weed in here. Weed? I'm not smoking. But oh, it might, it might be the remnants of the food that you don't like I made earlier, but you can't smell it anymore. You cannot smell it anymore. If you guys did not watch our recent video on YouTube, she uh, does not it like this so one thing. It was so weird because you said, you said something like, oh, text me when you're leaving, and I'm like, oh, he's doing something, but I didn't know you no, were scared I, me. No, I thought, I, no, I was saying text me when you leave so I know when you're coming home so I can start filming. I didn't even mean to start the video off like that, but I had to. Let me see your nails. Let's see them. All right, rate them out of 10 mama squad damn i love them cute i like how simple they are but they still look sexy it's like simple but sexy and let me just say mariah is looking amazing today hey, you actually, can you take a picture of my nails for me yeah that's our night routine guys he takes photos for me that is not our night routine <laughs> at all yeah you do because sometimes i gotta take some photos you know what i mean <laughs> no, you, okay no all right so mariah told me to turn on the camera for some reason so before so. we get into our night routine oh first of all what are you doing fix this. I'm gonna need you since I'm gonna be the chef tonight and- Wait, you're cooking? We're both That cooking. is not how our night routine goes. We're I'm gonna tell cooking. you right now. Oh, don't eat. Nine out of the 10 no. times the I cook. No, we both cook. You have certain things that you're better at than me, so you have that task. I'm really good at other stuff. I'm not gonna now, argue, I'm not gonna argue. Before my yeah. feet okay. get hard from standing. Can oh my you God. untie these for me? You want me to untie it? This is not part of our night routine. Yeah, either. it is. All right. Let me just tell you guys. When I come home from whatever activity I do, you give me nice foot rubs, tell them. With lotion, you put so oil on them. So how this video's gonna go? To, babe, admit it, you put nice no, oil and No, I know, and, that's and not a thing. Lotion if on them. If you want it to be a thing, we can make it a thing, cause I'm not scared, but like, it's not a thing. You would actually like rub lotion on them and put oil on them? Yes. Oh, I would, if you guys. Boyfriend to. of the year. Don't, anyway, don't crease them. Oh my God, you have to loosen them. Don't break my ankles. Covers don't crease. Well, I don't care. What do you mean? D just take them off nicely. Oh I don't God. need a broken ankle, and then you gotta take me to the hospital. That's not part of the night routine. Oh my gosh. So you gotta be careful, I'm fragile. So basically how this night routine is gonna work, it's gonna be, if our night routine was perfect every day, this would be the perfect Mariah and Bill night routine. But I know it's not. every night's different. Some nights we don't even eat dinner. Like honestly, we just have like yeah, we have a snacks snack. and stuff. But, but tonight like, is gonna be the night. Usually like me and Bill, we do kind of like our own thing, I guess. Like I have my own routine, he has his own routine. And a lot of the times it's random because some nights we'll either go out, we'll do stuff or it's like I don't know you're playing games or I'm watching my TV shows but tonight we're gonna give you kind of like what we the breakdown like the breakdown and what we like normally do on a day-to-day -day basis but this is not gonna we're not gonna be adding anything that we don't do this is literally what we do every day and honestly like tell us what your night routine is and if it's different than ours or if it's like kind of similar because I feel like everyone has like a similar night routine it's just the order of, of the way they, they do, do it. it and a lot of people so we're actually making dinner at around 5 18 p.m. and everyone's like oh you guys are eating like grandma's like people don't usually make dinner until like I 7 like or 5 8. 36 but like I feel like that's normal. a good time especially when we're trying to eat healthy because you're really not supposed to eat after like, seven. You got breakfast at like what? You're supposed to eat it at like nine, eight. Yeah. But we eat our breakfast at like 11. 11, 12. And then you got lunch at like 2.30 for us, right? Yeah, 2.33. And then dinner at like five to yeah. six. Sometimes it's six, but sometimes it's five. So so I don't know if you guys find 5.18 being a grandma hour. I'm sorry to all the grandmas. But that's when we're making dinner. But that's when so we're making dinner. We're actually You're gonna have to live with it. Really good. This is our routine. Your mom's recipe. I'm I know. I'm excited. I'm hungry. Let's go eat. I have I know, three hours. I'm starving. <laughs> so okay, babe, breaking my damn back. That's not really part of it. So guys, these are the lucky four contestants of the night. Oh, and we can't forget 
No, this is your duty, okay? Oh my While God. I'm cooking the sauce. I thought you were making dinner, though. What is this? Okay, but you're, I'm making dinner, yes, but there's a part you have to help me with because while I'm making this. I'll make the chicken. The chicken. I'm gonna make a chicken. Mariah doesn't trust herself because so she thinks she's gonna like poison us with food. If you guys are looking for a good, healthy 4G of carbs, okay? Four grams. Four, I just say 4G, all right? G it says 4G. Or okay, oh, well, it says 4G. You guys get it. They're the Paul. Paul meaty noodles, they taste so good, and you would never think that they were. They don't taste good unless you put sauce on them, but after you put sauce on them, yeah. It's good. And I'm about to show you guys a fire sauce. Let's get it. All right, let's see what my baby guy is cooking up right now. Everything's looking pretty good, but. This is the look sauce at, coming oh together. It's, it'll start thickening the more it, like, you know, the time goes on. Let me tell you guys right now that this sauce looks like it would be so bad for you, but it's, it's actually very good for you. Yeah, it is. Literally, cream cheese, and you guys think that cream cheese is bad, but it's actually not. It's only, I don't even think it has any carbs. No, this it. is like a low carb, low calorie kind of sauce. And it's just like a, this is like a low carb dinner. Like, yeah. I don't even think we're even in taking a lot. Of carbs no, today. and like we've it. been really like trying to get better with like our diet and stuff even though it, it is really hard Especially being our age. We want to eat everything and eat out and stuff But we have been eating in moderation like, you know, we'll eat bad a little like, bit we and then we'll eat healthy for a little don't, bit We honestly aren't strict on ourselves because I feel like if we're strict we're gonna become like depressed But yeah. like we're like at a good medium like we have our days where we eat bad But yeah. like that's what I'm saying like but it's like we're not starving ourselves from the bad food Yeah, but like, you know, we're eating a little better and yeah. this is also the chicken that we're we're cooking right now. It still has Bill's a lot, chicken. lot left. Bill's but. the chicken king. Yeah, I'm the king cook. of cooking. As you can tell, Mariah loves looking at herself while she cooks. Because... No, I was on FaceTime with Meg, and I, <laughs> it came when I was Okay, Snapchat. okay. Look good. But this also brings me to our next main part of our night routine, which we do a lot, is laundry, guys. Our night routine is super lit. We're cooking dinner and we're doing laundry. It's really not that lit, but I got the towels done in the dryer. I'm gonna swap my clothes over into the dryer and put the rest of my clothes in the washer, let it run for a little bit, and then hopefully by the end of dinner, everything will be ready to come out, fold, and then put the rest of my clothes in the, in the dryer. We have a lot of clothes. Yeah, we do. It takes a while for us to finish our laundry, right? Babe? Dinner is served. served. No, I'm supposed to say that. You're not the one I supposed to say. <laughs> okay, maybe because you made it. You That's the only cooked the chicken. And what? listen, I cook the chicken, cut it's... the chicken. You can't go wrong with the sparkling ice. Oh, this is always mango. a night routine. Actually, 100%. my favorite one is pineapple coconut. Comment down below what your favorite ice drink is because mine is pineapple coconut. Yeah, coconut. literally, like that's always part of our like daily routine What's your, and everything. You didn't answer me. Oh, my favorite? Mm, I like the regular lemonade. You like the regular lemonade? Yeah, or like just one of like the Ew, the regular lemonade. The strawberry. That's so boring. Strawberry pineapple is pretty... coconut is the best flavor in the, the game. Cherry. The cherry, cherry is good. Oh. Uh, the, you're right. You're right. That was my favorite, but I switched. It, okay. You switched it? Yeah, I switched it. Why? Because you didn't want to be the same as me? You no, be because I like, okay, anyways. Besides that, we did finish dinner. We're gonna eat up right now. This is just some chicken, some palmini noodles with a, a homemade sauce. And this is actually one of my mom's recipes. She didn't create it, but she found it from someone. Yeah, and it's a very low carb and like, I just love it because it, it looks, looks amazing. unhealthy. It looks so unhealthy. It looks like you go to like Olive Garden and they just pop this on your plate. Like it looks but that good. If you go to Bill's on Instagram, she actually has it in her bio. So if you guys yeah. wanna make a replica, there you go. Bam, and you can eat up all this and stay healthy. Mm. All right, so this is the time of the day or the night, I guess, that uh, me and Mariah kind of split up for a bit. She goes to take off her makeup and do a bunch of other things. I don't really know what she does. Usually after dinner, we watch like our show on Netflix. And recently we just got into Stranger Things. I know it's crazy, but we've never seen Stranger Things until the past like week. And we're already on season four. We're starting season four next episode that we watch. So all the new episodes that you guys have been watching, we are just watching right now as well. And it's freaking amazing, we love it. So anyways, where we would literally sit down, watch Stranger Things, you know, maybe get a snack or something after dinner, or we hop on Fortnite because we like playing with our friends on there, like Mariah's twin sister, Meg. They like love playing Fortnite with each other just cause it's like something to bomb. Like they FaceTime all day long, but like Fortnite's just like their favorite game. So that's what I'm gonna be doing for the next like hour. So I don't know when Mariah's gonna come out of the bathroom, but whenever she she does we'll probably link back up but like I don't even know what this girl does half the time around the house she spends like 10 hours in there taking pictures and stuff so we'll see what happens
all right you guys so now it is time for the night routine where i take off my makeup i usually take off my makeup pretty early because after we film i just if i'm not doing anything i don't really feel like sitting in makeup i don't know if anyone else is like that people are always like oh my gosh you put your makeup on only to just take it off like a couple hours later and i'm like i know but like i don't know what it is i just don't like sitting in my makeup especially if i'm just like chilling and relaxing and usually after this like we do like well you guys will see but now it is time for my skincare and let me just say i I have been breaking out recently because I went from using proactive and listen I when I was using proactive I did not break out once it was the best stuff for my face and I know a lot of people will be like oh proactive isn't good for your skin but like I feel like it depends on your skin and everyone like has different views on everything and everyone's skin's different and for me it worked so good but when I went to my lash girl I tried using a different brand which oh my gosh guys I wish I could have loved it I mean I do love it like this is I love this product so much but it was just my face just broke out so much with it i wanted it to be my routine so bad you guys it was like the most best brand if you guys are looking for a good facial cleanser brand it's called pca skin the best stuff ever and i just i wish my skin cooperated with it but for some reason my skin just doesn't like me and says oh you need to be back on proactive. So I'm back on proactive. It's basically just like a one, two, three step process. Still trying to clear up my acne from when I switched over to PCA. So hopefully by the next month, my skin will be completely clear, but it is slowly but surely getting there. So I'm gonna do a little montage of me taking off my makeup and just like my whole routine getting ready for bed, which I'm not really going to bed, but I am going to bed same time. Just, I'm just chilling, you know? Oh, I don't know if I mentioned this. That I don't know if I did, but I ripped off my eyelash and I took out my big earrings. I don't know if any of you guys wear eyelashes, but all I have to say is taking those off at the end of the day is literally the best feeling. It's just like, ah, oh, it's like a weight lifted off your eyes. You can see more clear. Like it is just the best feeling ever. So comment down below. I know I've been having you guys comment a lot, but if you're a real one, you're watching all the way through, you know, I'm gonna be looking for the real ones. Cause next giveaway guys, I'm gonna be looking for that stuff. I'm gonna be looking to see who watches our videos all the way through. All right, guys, so now that I washed my face, I brushed my hair, put it back in a ponytail, I'm gonna change into some comfy clothes, so let's get it. You know what? Actually, this is like the first time I actually dressed cute in like a couple weeks. I feel like I've been just like lounging and I haven't really been like dressing up. And it's like the first time I actually kind of got myself looking cute today. So let's get into lounge clothes because I literally live in that. Comfy clothes it is. Literally, I love oversized t-shirts. It's so comfy. But now, usually I go out here and I meet up with Bill after I do that. But this room is looking a little bit messy. So I'm just gonna like clean this up super quick with you guys. Like, look at how dirty. All it basically is is like clean clothes that just need to be folded and never got the chance to. Uh, and we're leaving on Thursday to go to sh home to Chicago for Father's Day weekend. So I'm also packing as I go. But let's that's freaking clean. All right, guys, to make this short, sweet, and simple, I'm gonna snap my fingers and they're gonna it's gonna be clean, okay? Okay, so the mess is basically clean. I obviously still have stuff, um, but the bed's already clean. The only thing is this towel. But yeah, so the bedroom's clean. Now I feel good. Now it's time to chill. I don't know if Bill updated you guys, but this is the time we usually either game on Fortnite or we watch our show. But I think we're gonna be gaming tonight. So I'm excited. Let's hit it and let's get comfy. So Bill is going to enjoy the rest of his night playing Fortnite with Jordan. Not the rest of the night. I'm oh, sorry, not the rest of the night. But you're getting on too, right? Yes, but I'm gonna let you guys have a little boys time and then me and Meg will get on when she Do you like home. my camera stand guys? Mariah's using our stand right now so yeah, I just she's, have little, to set she's using the Louis Louis really stand. Quick. So yeah, I'm probably gonna watch Gilmore Girls or something right now by myself because mm -hmm. I'll have my little girl time and you. watch our show and be a part and I love you. Yeah. Have fun gaming. <laughs> okay. <laughs> 
So my favorite like feel good show that I usually watch when I don't have a show, to, like me and Bill usually watch our shows together. Like I can't start a series without him because it just doesn't feel right. I have to wait for Bill. So when I'm just kind of like chilling, hanging out, I usually turn on Gilmore Girls. It is such a feel good show. It's kind of like Friends where it's just like a good show feeling and you just like feel good when you watch it. So that's what usually I do when I'm like, I have like free time and I like go through my phone, check DMs on Instagram and kind of just like sometimes DM you guys back and I go through TikTok and I just go through our work stuff. So that's usually what I will do on my time um, away from Bill usually at this time. So not very interesting, but it is interesting at the same time. It's more just like a relaxed, I love like these type of nights because it honestly just like, you could just sit back, relax and just like chill because we're so busy all day long. So yeah. All right guys, so we're back together finally. We it's actually, 10:30. it's 10.30 at night. We actually played some Fortnite together. And then um, we actually got online, not just with her sister and her boyfriend, but with three other people or two other people. So we had like a, you know, cool squad going. We were all having some fun. Mariah already brushed her teeth. We forgot to film I her brush know, her teeth. I forgot, guys. I, I was, need like, to so though, tired, so. Right? I was like, Bill, Bill said, I'm like, oh no, I already And I was did like, it. we have to brush our teeth. We have to show them on camera. Mm -hmm. I didn't, I didn't brush my teeth yet, but I also, before we get into that, I wanted to show you what I do out here. So obviously it's really bright and stuff. And before we go to bed, we make sure usually all- Usually I'm in here already. Usually. Yeah, Mariah's actually in here already at bed. She Most goes to bed time. before me. Most of the time, like, 98% of the time I'm in here before Bill. But she doesn't like fall asleep before me. She just goes and lays down before me. But anyways, I make sure to go around, make sure all the doors are locked. I'm actually gonna set our alarm. Sometimes we set it during the day when we're here. Sometimes we set it when, uh, you know, we actually are going to bed, but we have an alarm system. So like on every single window and door, if the door or windows are opened anywhere in the whole house, no matter what door, no matter what window, the alarm will go off instantly and it'll be a loud, bad, annoying sound. And it'll actually call the cops if it goes on for long enough, which is awesome because it's, you know, it's, it's good to stay safe. We also make sure the doors are all locked before because, you know, don't want anyone running in here at night and stealing our food out of the fridge, like come on. Oh, and what's also cool about the alarm, if anyone tries to break the glass, we have glass break sensors, so it can sense when glass is actually breaking and uh, or cracking, and it'll sound the alarm too. But anyways, Alexa, turn all lights off. Bam, this is how our house looks at night. Yeah, TV LED, but not in here, this one's on. We have to shut that one off, but look at that. I have, the whole house looks like this at night. We have these little night lights everywhere. You're never too old for night lights. That's Mariah's vanity room. Her neon sign goes crazy at night. And then we have lights up there, which I probably need to dim a little more, but it looks so badass at night. Like if you come out and get water, it's not scary at all. Like the vibes at night in our house, it'd be 3 a.m. It looks good, right? I know, it feels, it's like homey. It's like a very homey feeling, good vibe. I love it. You know, <laughs> pleasant, dreamy, dreamy, sleepy, sleepy, sleepy. Oh, yeah. I'm really tired. Actually. <laughs> sleepy. Hold on, I gotta, I gotta change and still brush my teeth real quick. Well, hurry up. All right, one second. One second. Quick. I know. One second. <laughs> All right, I'm all done. It took me about like 10, 15 minutes, not that long, but uh, I feel like we're both exhausted. I'm like. This is just our night routine, and we we didn't film a lot of like the in between. I just feel I don't know why it just like hit me like 30 minutes ago it hit me and now it's ruined. Mariah was super like upbeat, exciting, and then it just like hits her where she just dies and she can't do anything yeah, else. And I think it's because like I've been so anxious. I don't know what it is. Like before I fly and I know I'm doing something fun, I get anxious the days before because I'm like itching my. I just Starts having like stomach aches. No, I actually, babe, I'm having my anxiety like TMI guys, but I'm having my anxiety number twos so you guys know that that's not good yeah no it's not i've been good really enough. anxious and my anxiety's been really bad actually recently but it's okay because... sorry guys for the depressing little moment no well what's that? you're not depressing you're just having anxiety because you're excited we're going to chicago in two days and i get to see meg's new place tomorrow and... we're gonna be seeing tomorrow we're leaving ah! and yeah so we're gonna go see our family it's also father's day happy birthday to you get your summer tight. <laughs> Happy Father's Day to all the fathers out there. You guys rock. <laughs> this doesn't show how tired we are. Fucking happy birthday. <laughs> <laughs> 
Um, but we've done a lot today. We went to the gym earlier. Today we worked out chest. Oh, I did just your hit, chest hurt? Yeah, a little bit. My chest hurts bad. I just hit 225 and I hit for my max bench. 225, right? which is like um, awesome. And I can do more. I know I can. Mine was 85, right? Yeah, you did 85 today. You did your max. Yeah. So we both did our maxes. I almost did my max twice. But other than that, that kind of wraps up our night routine. Obviously, days to day it changes. Some nights we go out all night. Some nights, you know, we go to restaurants or we're out with people or we're watching our show and then we'll go back and forth to doing stuff in between watching our shows, like making a snack or popcorn or just stuff like that. Yeah, know? like my our, my favorite snack right now is apples and peanut butter. Apples and peanut butter, yeah. We usually have at like, what, eight o'clock? Yeah. <laughs> Something yeah, like that. it's not bad. No, it's not bad. We go to bed at like 11, so that we're not eating like. Yeah, we don't usually that late. eat after like 9 yeah. o'clock. I try not to eat. But other than that, we hope you guys enjoyed our night routine. Once again, comment down below how this like is to compare to yours. Like, are you guys like kind of similar to us where it's like low key, it's just straight up like obviously the whole getting ready for bed or just hanging out watching Netflix? Are you guys like the party type where every single night you guys want to go I feel out like with your Monday friends and. Thursday, our night routine's the same, and then Friday, Saturday, Friday, Sunday, Saturday, no, no, Friday, Saturday. Friday, Saturday, it's different. Because it's the weekend. You guys, you don't have to go to bed. You can stay up all night, you know? Yeah, like, it's different. Like, we do so many different things. Like, some nights we do some, like, different stuff. Yeah, so, so this would be, like, our weekday night yeah, routine. Yeah, weekday night routine. But we hope you guys enjoyed. We're probably going to pass out anytime soon. Now we'll just anytime sit here. Soon. We'll be on our phone, or we'll watch, like, an episode real quick before we go to bed. That's usually how we finish out the night, right? Yeah. And then we just kiss and say we out. say we say we'll see you in a second and we go to bed. Oh yeah, we always say I'll see, you see you in a second. Because when you go to bed, you wake up. It seems like you've been sleeping for a second. But, yeah, really. You know, it's been eight hours. Is that hours. a good feeling knowing like you still have so many hours? And then when you wake up in the middle of the night at like four a.m., you're like, yes. yes, I can go back to bed. And then when you wake up at eight thirty, oh, nine, and you're like, oh, I have no. to get up. Yeah, it yeah. sucks. But How early do you guys wake up in the morning too? Are you guys early birds? Or We're you asking guys... you tons of questions. I How know. early do you wake up? I told Bomber Squad though, if they're real supporters, they'll answer all this. Yeah, that's if facts. If they watch all the way that's through, that's facts, we'll know. guys. Make sure to give this video a thumbs up. Also, follow us on Instagram because we are doing giveaways, and you have to be following our Instagram. That's the main thing in order to be entered. Guys, and liking our only, posts. We only have four Instagram accounts. I saw a fake account today that actually was trying to do giveaways on there, and it's not us. The only accounts we have is our. Maine are Mariah and Bill and Snap, Snap and Thor. Thor. Literally, that's, that's it. it. We would never, we would message you guys off our main Instagram or our We would tell page. you about the giveaway on our YouTube yeah. before anything. So yeah. don't believe any of that. Yeah, if, don't If there's it. a giveaway going on that we haven't said, that's fake. People yeah. just want to steal your money. Yeah. Scam you, yeah. yeah. But anyways, guys, good vibes. We hope you have a great day or night, whatever time you're watching this. And we will see you in the next, next video. But, but until, until then, then, peace. I love, love you guys. guys.